Hi, this is Lisa G, founder of Your Tasty Life. By now you've probably heard about how healthy oatmeal is for breakfast. Well, in just a moment, I'm gonna debunk why oatmeal is not what you think it is for breakfast, and in fact, it could be making you fat. Most people enjoy oatmeal in the morning. They'll have a packet of oatmeal. Back in the days when I used to eat oatmeal, I'd have two packets, but they'll have a packet or two of oatmeal. Maybe they're taking the time to make steel cut oatmeal, oatmeal, which is yes, healthier than the instant oatmeal. But nonetheless, they're having oatmeal with what? They're having usually a tablespoon or two of sugar added and then usually some fruit with it. So we're talking about having oatmeal for breakfast. It's generally not just oatmeal most people are having. But let's just go with this and let's just say that I'm going to have one packet of oatmeal in the morning and I'm going to have just one tablespoon of sugar on top of my oatmeal and I'm going to have one yellow ripe medium banana with my oatmeal. Do you know if you did that five days a week through the course of a month, you would be consuming the equivalent of five and a half cups of sugar. No kidding, five and a half cups of sugar having this healthy bowl of cereal. Well, obviously you can see I have a little bit different take on how healthy oatmeal is for breakfast. And here's another interesting take on the story. That five and a half cup equivalent sugar load to your body that is the culprit for raising your blood sugar, making it difficult for you to lose weight, and also raising your cholesterol. So what can I do, you're thinking? Today's TMWTD is pretty simple. Don't fall victim to the healthy bowl of oatmeal in the morning. If you're going to have oatmeal, look at making some harm reduction moves. The first step would be to replace the high glycemic banana, meaning the banana raises one's blood sugar quite a bit, with some lower glycemic fruit like berries. The other thing you could do is replace the sugar, such as brown sugar or white sugar, with different options such as stevia or something like swerve. These things aren't going to give you the blood sugar surges, which lead to higher insulin levels, and those higher insulin levels are culprits in raising our appetite and weight gain, as well as raising our blood cholesterol from having too much carbohydrate or sugar intake. So now, that's a tasty bite you can sink your teeth into.